Hello, um, the audio is not working correctly, please forgive me. Um, this will have to suffice for now. So today I'm going to be doing two problems because I both missed these on the midterm two. So the first one is number eight for the short answer. It reads, the pH of point A molarity base is nine. What is the value of KB? And because pH is in nine and KB is usually related to POH, we want to find the POH for nine. So to find POH, we do pH plus POH equals 14 with that relationship. <coughs> Excuse me. Next we do, to find the POH, we want to isolate it. So we do 14 minus pH equals POH. And we just plug in the numbers, 14 minus 9 we equal POH. And that will result in the POH equal 5. And because now we have POH, we can find the concentration of OH minus which can help us later on to find the KB. So 1 times 10 to the negative POH is related to the OH. And that will give us 1 times 10 to the negative 5. Now that we have this relationship, we can make an ice chart with the initial change in equilibrium. So it will be base plus the B minus plus the OH minus. B plus, excuse me then our initial change in equilibrium. So the initial for B would be 0 0.8 molarity, the B minus would be 0, and the OH would be 0. And because it's a forward reaction, we want to have the X's move forward, and then so the reactants will lose 1 times 10 to the negative 5, and the products will gain 1 times 10 to the negative 5. Then we solve for the equilibrium, which is 0.A minus 1 times 10 to the negative 5. And B minus would be 1 times 10 to the negative 5. And OH would be 1 times 10 to the negative 5. Now that we have our equilibrium numbers, we can make um, find the equilibrium of the whole thing, which would be 1 times 10 to the negative 5 squared over 0.8 minus 1 times 10 to the negative 5. This is based on the relationship of products over reactants. And after that, we get our answer 1.25 times 10 to the negative 9, 10. That is the answer to number 8. Um, I'm back again, and this is the question for number 9, 11, excuse me, for the salt for NaHSO4. We're trying to figure if it's acidic, basic, or neutral. So first things first, from the salt, we want to split them up into its um, perspective things. So we know that Na makes NaOH and HSO4 splits up into H++ SO4 to minus. So we know that NaOH is a strong base and that it basically dissociates completely making a spectator ion. So base because it's a spectator ion, it is neutral, making the NaOH part neutral and the Na plus neutral. Now that we know the H plus and SO4 to minus, it is actually kind of acidic because it has an H plus because it's a polyprotic acid, making it allowing it to um, donate hydrogens into the solution, making the whole thing slightly acidic. Thank you.